Should Portugal pay reparations for its role in the slave trade? Well, that's what the president said recently. Marcelo Rebelo de Souza said that Portugal should pay the costs of slavery, prompting a heated debate inside Portugal. Portugal did trade slaves, more than 6 million Africans, but not just Africans, also Asians and Indians. Your responsibility shifting. The West refuses to repent for its historical sins against Africans. So how many Portuguese do you know who have slaves right now? <laughs> none, as far as I know, none. Absolutely. And of course, they need to gaslight the issue. It has a time frame with which we decide to pay attention to it, and it won't go beyond that time frame. So for instance, the Portuguese were colonized first by the Moors, and the Barbary pirates from North Africa. So should they ask for reparations? Well, you can choose a time frame where you pay attention to it, and then you can go back to La La Land. That does not mean that Africa, with 1.2 billion people, have forgotten a single thing about slavery. One historical event is not equal to the other. The more civilization, or the Tekrurian one, Ghana, Songhai, ancient Egypt, they were medieval civilizations with slavery, but that is not the same as what the West did, coming there with cannons and muskets taking Africans by the millions in chains, dehumanizing them and belittling them for 400 years until this day and continuing. Look, the West is so incredibly illiterate in African political opinion. They like to talk about these African issues, but never take anyone from Angola or Nigeria or Ghana to the show of Redacted. I have many followers from Nigeria, Ghana, Kenya, South Africa, and Africa has not forgotten anything about slavery, colonialism, exploitation of African resources, lying about African history, stealing African monuments, and the youth in my comment section is very, very angry, and they are very much about justice.